So imagine this, you're sleeping in your room, suddenly you awaken to gunfire and the headboard of your bed is shot up. Yeah, so that's what a local grandmother says happened to her. Mary Bear tells us more about this woman's terrifying night. Mary? That grandmother is too frightened to speak with us on camera, but she shared with us how she lived through a barrage of bullets fired into her home in Northwest Jacksonville. We concealed her identity for her safety. It was a close call. The bullets, I don't know anything about guns, but it's powerful. I mean, you see the holes here look small, but when they hit, go through and hit the house. Nothing could prepare that 74-year-old grandmother for what happened in her own home last night when she woke up to bullets flying. She called 911, telling them... They're shooting the house up now. Literally, there was still shooting in the house. A shot hit right above her headboard in her bedroom. And if I had been sitting up watching TV, my brains would be all over the bed. She dropped to the floor. Her grandson and his friend were also in the house. I'm like, I'm on the floor. I'm crawling. I'm crawling down the hallway, like, trying to see if they're okay. When the police got there, she says she couldn't believe what she saw. I was like, oh, my God. And see, this happened once before, and it's all like retaliation for my grandson. Her 17-year-old grandson was arrested and named a suspect in a Powers Avenue murder that happened back in January. His father says his five siblings have received threats ever since and says yesterday one of the brothers received a message on social media that he wasn't safe, quote, even at granny's. I told him when it, that fight was saying, we got your brother. We got your brother locked up. Now we're going to get you. And we know where you live. Her address is listed as her grandson's home on his multiple arrest reports. She told News for Jax that she's frustrated that young people are so lost and caught up in the violence. And she worries the retaliation will continue. Mary Bear, Channel 4, The Local Station.